what's going on everybody? Um, today we're going to be talking about uh, microphones. I just got this <clears throat> uh, new mic. Uh, it's called the uh, Deity VMic D3 Pro. Um, I did a lot of research on YouTube about it to see if it was going to be a good mic for recording videos. Now normally I use more of like a a, a, a like a professional semi-professional condenser microphone uh, into a small uh, mixing board and then uh, go with the I think it's a is it 16th inch or 18th inch or whatever a TT connector into my Canon T3i but I was looking for something that I didn't have to lug around this mixer and this other microphone and microphone stand and all that I wanted something I could just put right on top of the of the camera so it's be a little bit more portable so that's what I'm talking through right now. That's what you're listening to is the Deity, I have to look down and see what it is, Deity VMic D3 Pro. Um, I think it's made by Aperture. I'm, I'm not 100%, but I think so. So I'm kind of comparing and contrasting that a little bit with my normal setup. Um, you, you clearly hear me talking, so uh, I guess you kind of get in a sense of what it would sound like with that. I'll be quiet for a second so you could just hear the my air conditioner's running so you might hear that. Okay. I don't, I don't know if that's a good silence test or not, but that was, you know, I tried. Um, <laughs> the Deity mic has some settings on it. I'm going to show you guys that with the uh, when I take the mic off and film it in another room so you can see the settings, but just explain them to you. There's a there's a low cut roll off of 75 hertz and below or 150 hertz and below. So right now I'm gonna I'm gonna use the. This is what it sounds like with the 75 hertz roll off. Um, I guess I should have been playing guitar too. One thing to keep in mind. My guitar is sitting down here. The mic is coming at me about right at this angle. So it's <clears throat> it's a shotgun mic and it's hitting me here. So it's got some off axis rejection. So it's probably rejecting some of my guitar down there. If I pull it up here. So we can see a little bit. I have it more directed at the sound hole. So we see what that sounds like. Let's do the, this is the 150 hertz roll off. So this is everything below 150 hertz uh, is what it's cutting. They also call these high pass filter switches because you're letting the high frequencies pass through and you're cutting the low frequency. That, that's how I am able to always remember what high pass is really trying to tell me is that it's letting the high frequencies pass through but it's cutting the low frequency. So this is the uh, 150 cut. Be on silent for a second to see if it'll drown out any of the hum of the air conditioner. Okay, you heard the silence. Now let's listen to the guitar. Let's set it back to the normal setting. So now it's on the normal setting with no no cuts happening whatsoever. I'm trying to remember to look into the camera instead of looking at the monitor. And um, again, let's listen to what it sounds like. So we see what that sounds like. 
little silence there. Um, anyway, so this is the Deity D3 Mic Pro. Um, Deity v, v Mic D3 Pro. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to unplug this microphone. Um, I'm going to plug up the... I've got an AKG, AKG Perception... <clears throat> um, Perception mic, uh, Perception 220 mic, <clears throat> and the AKG mic has a, it does have a roll off switch too. I'm not sure which frequency that it cuts when it rolls off, and it has a negative 20 dB pad on it too. Um, one thing I did want to mention is the setting inside the the camera. I've turned the gain all the way down. I have a Canon T3i, and I've turned the gain all the way down. And then I and then I moved, bumped it up five notches, so one, two, three, four, five, because it's got like a little step, you know. So I went up five notches of gain. The deity is all the way up. I keep it all the way up because, long story short, is the deity. If I have the camera set to the lowest setting, like one notch above zero, the deity won't be loud enough to give me the gain that I want so that it will measure between negative 12 and negative 6 dB. So if that makes sense. So I keep the gain inside the camera up five notches and then that way I can um I can I can have I set the deity all the all the way up maximum. Um <clears throat> this is kind of what it will sound like if I'm just trying to record regular YouTube videos. Again, the microphone will be sitting below. You ain't gotta come, cause we've done set it up. But if I ever see you again, you just be my friend. Um, yeah, so that's what that sounds like. Let's push pause on the camera. Let's get the perception uh, mic plugged up. I think I've told you everything about the deity. Okay, what's up, guys? We're back. Um, now we're di we're I've got the perception uh, two twenty AKG perception two twenty mic plugged in, just to give that some comparison uh, to the to the deity D three. Um, I'm pretty much sitting the same distance I am from the camera. But the perception mic is kind of off to the side down here. Um, it's about the same distance from the guitar, but it's sitting lower and faced more towards the guitar. I've been playing with the mics over the last few days. I kind of think the, the, the setup with the perception going through the mixer gives it more body to the guitar, more low end. It does have a low end cutoff filter switch. what that sounds like you obviously hear my voice talking now it's quite the contrary I'm kind of talking up here but the mic is sitting kind of at this level so it's hitting the guitar so you can kind of see the difference um <clears throat> both of them I can probably get decent YouTube videos out of like I said the 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 deity is going to be more portable you ain't gotta come. We've done set it on But if I ever see you You just be my friend All right, let me do the cut off the low frequency uh cutoff switch It's going to be pop ah Kind of makes a pop when you do that so so now i've got the low frequency cutoff switch on air conditioner is running again so i don't know if it's killing me at home So yeah, 
yeah um we'll i'm gonna show you what these mics look like um but you've seen how they sound you've seen how the perception sounds also on the perception i'm going through a elisis usb 2.0 a multi-mix 8 usb 2.0 uh, mixer i'll show you a picture of that too and kind of how i have everything set up um yep wearing these headphones because I'm able to actually come off of the mixer so since the mic is plugged into the mixer and I've got the headphones monitoring the mixer I can hear the mic sound coming through this mixer another advantage of doing the mixer th thing is that some mixers have onboard effects like this one so I could dial in a little bit of reverb I think advantage except that your voice gets echoey too when you do that yeah let me turn that down <clears throat> so anyway i hope that you found this uh video useful um yeah let me know what you think if you could hear the difference between the two microphones like i say it's not like a, any kind of perfect test or anything like that per se um the Deity microphone is, I think it's a $200 microphone. This pers this SK, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> AKG microphone I've had for a few years, quite a few years. I want to say it was a couple hundred dollars too. I mean, you can look it up and see. But the downside is for the for the AKG setup, you're gonna, you know, you need an external mixer, and then you're going from the mixer to the uh, camera. You have a lot more flexibility off of what you can do EQ wise. Um, yeah, you can mess with the highs, the lows, and all that. But the Deity is going to be a lot more uh, portable. Uh, for the money, I think I got a good deal. I don't, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. If uh, you know, if it was, if it was a good purchase or not, I'm not sure. I just, uh, I like it for what. If I want to go and shoot on location, I've got this mic above the camera, and I know it's pretty high quality, decent quality, and um, so it kind of serves that purpose. Uh, yeah. Anyway, peace.